Hi everyone. So I finally finished this sketchbook and um, I'm glad I did. It took me only five months because I started this year um, really diving into art again. And at first I was very experimental. I really didn't know what to do. So I was just playing with different mediums and techniques. And this was just what on what, just to see what I could do. And most of these are done when I'm at work and I have an hour of lunch and just want to paint and kind of get away from work and focus on new techniques. And um, I bought some black brush pens and tried to integrate them in to um, my paintings. Um, and I'm finding they're very water soluble. The one I was using here was the Pentel brush pen, pocket brush pen. And um, so I just kind of went with it, you know, and um, and then this one was inspired by Danica Sills. She's another YouTuber, and she's wonderful. She has some really great, beautiful women um, paintings and digital paintings. Um, and um, I'm trying to use gouache more and try to figure out gouache. So I'm using brush pen and gouache here. And a lot of these are done without... Uh, pencil sketch. I just kind of go in with the pen and then with the watercolor over the pen or vice versa. And a lot of times it ends up being watercolor first and brush pen second, but this is only after I'm learning, you know. And this one's I really was proud of when I finished it. I just thought it came out really well. This actually does have brush pen in it. And, um, I just like the reflection of the water. It looked pretty cool. I thought about framing it. I joined this um, app called Sketchy, and it's all portrait um, help for people, artists who want to try out their different people. And you just load a picture of yourself, and you start painting other people, and they paint you, and it's really cool. So these are from that app, and these are real people. Um, and even this one, and that day was just really didn't have much time, so I was just kind of going with something kind of political, like save the earth and what are we doing to our earth kind of theme, because um, I just sort of feel like we're really not paying attention to what the earth's kind of telling us. So but there, there was actually in a girl holding up a uh, a microscope, not a microscope, but a, a Ooh, I don't even know what they're called now. I'm because I'm rushing. Well, this one was done with all brush pen and um, water on a on a brush. And this was mostly marker, and then um, a wash of watercolor. And um, I was pretty proud of. I just after not doing art for so long and then coming back to it, it's really kind of cool how you can get back into it and, and sort of impress yourself with what you do, you know, after so long of not doing it. Um, and this was a, a model on Instagram that I asked to do her portrait, and she said, sure. And I um, just kept going with that theme because it just seemed to work well. And um, just doing a lot of very pretty women with long hair, with flowy hair. And then I was like, eh, let's mix it up. This is a Scottish man I was trying to um, paint, and I just found a day to do it. So this is a this is gray marker with watercolor wash. And you gotta do the obligatory skull. So I did that, and it's probably not a perfect skull, so I'll, let's just flip the page. <laughs> this is another sketchy app portrait, and um, I really wish I had spent more time on the leaves, or the grass, grasses or leaves or whatever it was. Because it would have been a lot more detailed and, and really neat. Um, this is also from the Sketchy app. <clears throat> and um, I called it Password. I thought it was cute that, that someone had a cat in their door. I love cats, so it came out quite well. This one I like because it was so simple. Um, I was just pen and then the watercolor wash. 
really light wash. Um, my proportions are a little off, but it came up pretty well. And this is another one I'm proud of. I actually did a watercolor wash of this person um, at work, and then I brought it home and was excited to finish it with gouache. And I do have another video of it on here that you can check out. I'll leave all links um, at the end. Just another portrait. Something different. Another one. And this one, I kind of wish I had done the hair a little differently, but it came out okay. And this is the last page, and I thought I'd do some pizzazz by doing some opera pink and bright colors and blowing them away with a, a straw. So I'm feeling pretty accomplished. Thanks for watching.